Hi and welcome to Next Day Solar. Today we're going to show you the solar powered windmill. Now windmills are very interesting things, they originate from America and in Holland there are over a thousand working windmills even today. Now windmills originally used to pump water from the very low areas where it was flooded to higher areas so those low areas could be farmed. So windmills have a lot of history but today we're going to use windmills to look at the future and the future for us is all about sustainability, it's all about using solar and solar powered energy to make the world a cleaner and greener place. Now the first thing we'll do is just unpack the kit and make sure we've got everything we need. And as you're starting to put this kit together, you'll find yourself starting to learn about solar and about all the amazing things that can come from it. Okay, so we're gonna start building our solar powered windmill kit and the first thing that you're gonna need is this nice wooden round base here. And you're just going to apply the first piece to our solar powered windmill, which are the legs. So we'll just apply some small glue, just there. Just a dollop will do and just pop, pop them in. Fantastic. Now my base is in place and we're going to now take the base of the actual windmill itself. So again, I'll just pop some glue and it can be easy just to pop it either side there and there, there. Now small hands can do this, it doesn't matter if you make a little bit of a mess, you're going to paint it, you're going to decorate it afterwards. So I'll just take my base and I'll just ease it on. Slightly tight, just start with one side and I'll just ease it on forward and back, forward and back. Now we'll start with the sides of the windmill. Now there are two sides and they are slightly different. You've got the side which is the regular side then you've got the side with the engine or motor that's going to pop out. So I'll just apply some glue just lightly to the edge here and just lightly to the edge there. Pop my first piece in place. And we'll just pop that in. One corner goes in first and there we are. Okay, now the next section is to pop in one of the sides. Now you can just squeeze that in Okay, so we've got three sides of our windmill now and then we're going to be at the point where we're ready to pop in the motor. Now the motor's here and we're going to be having the wires come out from the top. So you can just place that in. It'll be quite a nice tight fit. There is a little cut you can see down the middle there to allow you to ease that in. And then we're ready to place the final door into the windmill. And I can rest it on its side and just gently squeeze together and that will clip nice and firmly in place. Great, now we've got our windmill ready and we're ready to build the arms of the windmill together. Now within your kit you would have located this very small little grommet. Simply place it down there, place the first windmill arm like so and then what I would do at this point is apply some glue, take my second windmill arm and you want to make sure that it's nice and square and you've got your perfect, perfectly square, perfectly 90 degree windmill. Now the next step is actually to mount that to and just check that that can spin nice and freely like so. Great, we're almost there and we're getting ready now to put on our roof. Now, I'll take my cables and I want to thread them through the roof, nice and easy, squeeze it on, there we go. Nice firm fit there. Take my second piece and just apply the same process. Now we're ready for the bit that we're all excited about, which is to fit our solar panel to the windmill. Now on the top there, we've got two points, red for plus, and black for minus and we'll just loosen those. Now you can happily loosen them with your finger or like me, if you've got a small screwdriver, you can just do the same. So I'll just put that down and I'll just loosen those up a little bit. So take the first cable, pop it through the hole like that. Just use your finger to hold it the other side and then just tighten up. And you know, if you, you are teaching young children about this, you might want to draw out that red is positive and black is negative to make sure that you get the right yeah, cable in the right hole. And if you do reverse it, your windmill will spin in reverse and you won't be able to grind any grain or flour or pump any water, that's for sure. So both my cables are in. I've got the right cable in the right slot, which is a good start. And now I'm going to tuck the cables gently inside the windmill. It's just apply a little bit of glue. Now it's really important that you don't put any glue in this area here. This is where the contacts are. You don't want to touch that at all. But this area, this lower area here, where you've got the voltage of the solar cell that we're using is absolutely fine and into place. Now you might want to just hold it for a moment while it sets. I'm going to take my handy light here and just shine it on. And as you can see, they're starting to spin. Fantastic. There we go. Now you don't have to use this, just we're inside a studio here, so we haven't got much natural light. Thank you for watching. We hope you enjoyed watching. That was the solar windmill from Next Day Solar. Thank you.